Local businesses are among those hoping for some help. And our Jason Sloss joins us live from Kearney Mesa with that part of the story. Jason. Andrew, heavy demand for the second infusion of emergency funds. Even just in this small shopping center, there are several small business owners who hope to have better luck this time around. Time and money are quickly running out for many local small businesses, like the Tofu House in Kearney Mesa, where owner Junsa Kim is once again applying for an emergency loan through the government's Paycheck Protection Program. He says business is down more than 90% and has had to let most of his workers go. I was trying to, to rehire and new hire them with a PPP promotion, so loan, yes. Kim came up empty earlier this month after the government offered $350 billion in forgivable loans for small businesses. But in a matter of days, the money ran out. And a lot of that money did not go to businesses that needed it the most. What went through your mind when you found the money ran out the first time? Maybe we have to close our business. How can I keep our employee? And how am I have to pay for rent? Next door at O'Brien's Pub, General Manager Tyson Blake says he got approval for a loan from the first round, but applied again since no money has come in. Like having your heart like pulled into your stomach and digested, it's nuts. Yeah, it's it's uh, nerving and unsure, and uh, but we're staying positive. It's a race for the money, as some analysts believe the $310 billion in new PPP funding could be gone in less than a week. Failure is not an option. We're going to do this, baby. <laughs> Please well, send funding. <laughs> and back to the other restaurant owner we talked with. He says things have gotten so bad he's already a couple of months behind on rent. And if he can't get this loan, he's really not sure how much longer his business can survive.